and Ann and Susan. She's watching from Indiana. Kim is here from Central Florida. Uh, Christine is a first timer. Hi, Christine. Welcome. Hey, I hope you guys loved our big craft day. I hope your stuff has arrived. I think I saw some people Facebooking the boxes that have arrived. <gasps> I have to mention my today's special arrived from Sarah Davies and Crafters Companion. Give me thumbs up if yours have arrived. I hope it has. I was so excited. It was, I mean, I knew what it looked like because I'd seen it all, right? But the other day, I really took my time. I, even on the air, didn't get to see all the uh, sayings on the stamps. So I took my time and really looked at it. I was like, this is a great kit. So anyway, I'm very happy my today's special came in the mail already. Karen's a first timer. Hey, Karen. Another Karen's joining me. There's two Karens in a row. And Mary Ann's here from Georgia. And Patricia uh, is from Texas. <laughs> Howdy, Suzanne. So glad I made the live again. Thank you for joining me. Carol's here. And Robin's here. First timer from Syracuse, New York. Love Syracuse. That's nice. Hey, you get a little thumbs up on that one. Uh, Deborah's here from Baltimore and Jennifer from Tennessee. Veronica from Jamaica, New York. I love that. Jamaica me laugh. That's the, that is the worst joke. You know what? This is a free-for-all, okay? Clearly, I do not have a good comedy writer. <laughs> Evelyn, you have to be my comedy writer next. Can I tell you a bad joke? I think okay, she's going to tell us a bad joke. You want to come over here and do it live? No. You're just going to tra I'll translate? Okay, here's Evelyn's bad joke. We have a new lighting person. We have a new lighting person. Is Their this part of the joke? Sydney. And I said... Their name is Sydney? And I said, how's Australia? Oh, she said, and how's Australia? Did you get noogied, like head noogied? That is a terrible joke. Okay, mine I think was funnier. I'm just, you tried though, you tried. LB's here, hi LB, and Reagan, I love Stamps of Life. Stephanie and Ken have an amazing business. They do, and all of us need to buy their products tonight. I'm just saying that. Everybody needs to jump in and go, yay. Uh, Melina's here from Milwaukee, and Janet and Jamie, she loves Stamps of Life. Patty's here, great to see you again, great to see you. Antony is here. Hello, Suzanne. Hi, baby. Sharon is here. Oh, wow. I love you, Suzanne. My first. Oh, thank you. Um, Alice is here. She's another first timer. Oh, I have all these first timers. I love it. Uh, Wanda from Virginia and Sharon from Arkansas. Bertha's joining us from Tennessee. Uh, Sally. Hi, Stephanie from Deer Trail, Colorado. Oh, I bet it's beautiful there. Susan. Oh, wow. I missed it. No, you didn't miss it. You are right on time, Susan. You are here. It is live. It is happening. It's great. And I'm glad you're here. Anita says, hello, Suzanne. I've been watching you for years. You're a wonderful host from Northeast Arkansas. Oh, thank you so much. It makes me feel so good. All right, Kristen is here from Kentucky, and Sharon says, congratulations. Uh, Angela says, oh, congratulations that my husband has stayed with me for 34 years. <laughs> what am I getting congratulated on on that one? I'm not sure. I know it wasn't Evelyn's really horrible joke. Not congratulations. That was a terrible joke. All right. Oh, speaking of congratulations... Stay tuned. I have a segue into congratulations. Get it? I check with Evelyn to make sure she's staying with me. Wow. <laughs> Pat from, oh, Pat, stop it. This is not a place. Can you see that one, Evelyn? Mm. Mid -a -did -a -did -a oh, mid-a-did-a-dip-pippy? I don't know where that is. I don't believe that's a place. I think that's funny. Mm -hmm. Robin, love North Carolina. Love Suzanne and Crafter's Companion. I hope you got your today's special. Uh, Kathy says, howdy from Texas. Love Stephanie and Ken of Stamps of Life. You always have the best guests. Thanks. I, I have really good guests, and we do such different variety. In fact, everything you're going to see has never been on the air before. Usually, that's what we do in this show. And we've got lots of cool surprises still coming up. I'm not allowed to tease to them anymore. <laughs> but, you know, just tune in every Tuesday night, and you'll find out. It's I'm going to go, what? It's time to make it's got to be Mississippi. The S are right next to oh, okay. You think it's Mississippi? It's got, I mean, that's, a, that's, a spell, that's a heck of a spell check right there. All right. Chrissy's from Texas and Karen. First timer. Howdy from Sacramento, California. Hi, Karen. Hi. Teresa's here from Northern Illinois and Shannon's joining us from Columbia, Missouri. Uh, let's see. Virgo. It's Virgo. Uh, Elena says, first timer from Western Washington. I love this. Hi. Carol from Cleveland, Ohio. Karen's giving me thumbs up. Susan's giving me a thumbs up. Oh, that's because you guys got the uh, Today Special. And it arrived. That's great. Julie, hi, everyone. Pat's from Mississippi. Donna's from Phoenix, Arizona. Alicia from Downey, California. Julie, she got hers. It's awesome. It is awesome, isn't it? Uh, let's see. We have Debbie. Yes, her arrived on Friday. Love it. Isn't that fun when you open the box? It's like Christmas. Uh, Sandy, still waiting for the order. Well, hopefully it'll be there soon because it looks like a lot of us are indeed getting it. Patricia, I'm a broken getter from craft day. Love all my goodies. Okay, be careful. We always want you to be careful with that, but I'm sure you had a good time. You liked that $5 fill the cart, didn't you? 
We all do. All right, Marilyn says, hi, Suzanne. Happy Crafty Tuesday. I think my TS arrived while I was out to dinner. All of my other craft day stuff came already, and I can't wait to use them. Yay, good. Sharon says, yes, all my something came, just tried, emphasize on trying to put it away. I'm not sure what that means. We're, well, I hope it's okay, Sharon. Patricia's from Staten Island, New York. Hello. Uh, Melinda, Melina is here. I got my organ and organized them for the crop I'm going to at the end of the month. How fun is that? I was interesting. I was with some girlfriends of mine that I played tennis with, and we were celebrating my friend Linda's birthday. And her name's Linda, and I gave this egg card because we used this really cute. It Was that one from Steph? Stephanie, what? it was hers. Oh, well, I made this um, chick. And it says, hey, chickadee. It was Steph's, uh, Steph's life. Anyway, I gave her the card that I made. And she was like, oh, my God. And all the girls were like, oh, Suze, can, would you come over and we'll just have a card baking afternoon? And I said, look, as long as there's booze, I'm in. <laughs> so we're going to do it. Won't that be fun? I said that we're, there is always a lot, of, a lot of Prosecco in those things. Hi, Pat. And Patricia is joining us. How are you doing? I'm doing great. I hope you're doing Weblin. What a cool name. Weblin. I love that name. First timer from Cypress, Texas by Houston. Well, hello. Uh, Joanna's joining us. Hello from Parkersburg, West Virginia. Jo I think I said it right. No, Jonah. Jonah, I said it right now, I think. All right, let's see. I'm going to keep going. Janet's joining us in Joyce. What did I miss? Nothing. I'm just still doing shout outs. So you are in the right place. You're good to go. Karen, my first trail, Colorado, beautiful there too. I didn't know you didn't miss it. You're right on time, Susan. You are here. It's live. It's, oh, yes. Yes, it is. It's live. It's going. This is happening. All right, I got to keep going faster because Evelyn gives me that, that eye. Uh, Patty and Sharon, no way. It was years of marriage. Yeah, 34 years. Yeah, I know, right? God bless that man. <laughs> Actually, he's ornery. Like, you know what? It's, it's a 50-50 street on, you know, being together for 34 years. Oh, yeah. oh, and then COVID. Okay, we live in under 700 square feet. I am not kidding you guys. Under 700 square feet. And when COVID hit, he had to stay home from work. You want to test a 34-year-old marriage? <laughs> you want to test a three-year-old marriage? Yeah, you want, you want to test a six-week-old marriage? <laughs> you have to stay home from COVID in under 700 square feet with two white dogs. Ah! All right, Kathy's joining us. Can't wait for the show. Carmen, hello from Chula Vista, California. Melody from mid-Michigan, Maryland. Uh, by the way, Michigan, get warm for gosh sakes. That's all I'm saying. Patricia, Suzanne, I love the picture of you and your husband in your Vegas outfits. Hey, if you follow my Facebook page, you'll see a lot of the crazy stuff I do. Yeah, so I like posting the crazy stuff, so it's fun. Sharon, congratulations on years of marriage. Thank you very much. Lori's here. Uh, let's see. Cynthia is here. First timer. Hi, Cynthia. Jerry's here from Oklahoma. Janet. Hey, Suzanne. It's Stephanie from Area of Georgia. All my items arrived yesterday from HSN's Craft Day. I can't wait to use them. Did not get the TS, but got Crafter's Companion Hummingbird set. <gasps> oh, I don't think there's one even left. Evelyn, maybe you can check. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Just let me take a moment, Janet, and, and let's have a moment here together. If you guys missed the hummingbird set, I, I've got this because this TikTok guy who loves hummingbirds, I'm kind of into hummingbirds now. They're always kind of fascinating, but he's like, crazy what he does. It's really neat what he records and captures him in slow motion. It's neat. Anyway, uh, Crafter's Companion did a giant, a giant hummingbird set. It was, pro is it still in stock? It was, is it really? Because we sold it out, so there must be a couple left then. Seven, eight, six, oh, here's the item number. Five. Seven, eight, six, Seven nine five. At least go look at it. Karen's online with us. She's part of our team on the social side. I'm not sure she can pop it up, but there's the item number for you. If you haven't seen Janet's hummingbird kit that she bought, it is spectacular. It's one of the prettiest kits I've ever seen. It's really something. All right, thanks for adding that. Lori from New Jersey. Betty and is here. And another Lori. Got mine too. Love it. Pat, sorry, I'm typing in the dark. Oh, oh, Pat had all the funny. <laughs> Pat, not, why, not sure why you're typing in the dark, but I don't care as long as you're with us. All right. Let's, oh, wait. Just do me a favor. Get the first timers. Jerry's a first timer. And Bridget and Terry. I did love the $5 fill your cart from Patricia. I love it. I'm going to go a little faster. Sorry, guys. Lori, uh, yay for Stephanie. Excited for the stamps of life. We are Patricia. Boozy Susie, LOL. <laughs> that is great. I might have to make a t-shirt with my cricket that says Boozy Susie. My, my tennis friends would crack up. They'd be like, well, she got that right. Carol says, hair looks lovely. I made copy. Yeah, it is the lazy night hair. I'm sorry. I already did it. I was on from midnight to two last night and already fluffed my hair. I just couldn't do it a second time. But thank you. I appreciate it. It's my frozen Elsa look is what it is. All right, Carol got all her craft stuff, got sick. Oh, 
Hope you're feeling better. Take care of yourself. Dee's here. Lou, I know I got to keep moving. Judy, hello. Patricia and Tammy. And you guys are always so funny. I love reading your comments. Uh, Lenine is here from Beverton, Washington. And Michelle and Jennifer, why 700 square feet? I could never. Uh, we wanted to downsize. You know, I've always been really comfortable in small spaces. They have to have high ceilings, but I could live in small space. And the reason we did is our son went off, graduated from college, kind of doing his thing. And my husband and I uh, really wanted to downsize and make our life simpler and not have so much stuff. Although, literally, I'm not kidding you. I will pose. Uh, here's what I'll do. I will send a picture to Evelyn for next Tuesday. No, the Tuesday after. And I will show you my kitchen. And then I'm going to show you how much of it is crafting stuff. That is one thing I was not good at downsizing. I couldn't get rid of the crafting stuff, of course, and I had tons of it. So, All right, Patty, celebrating 50 years in December. I love it. All right, so I'm getting the wave on. Uh, do it. Make the t-shirt. I should. Love any craft you do. Thank you, Betty Ann. And hi from Lou. And Brenda just joined the party. Has Stephanie already been on? No, you are in perfect timing, Melinda. All right, Stephanie is my guest tonight. We're going to get started right now, and we have one, two, three, four things that we are going to create and love. Now, if you'd like to order any of them that you see, Miss Karen on our social team, she's going to put up on your screen, on the comments, a way to order without having to leave the experience. So we make it really easy. Now, the other thing that's really, it's been happening a lot lately, is we are selling out of stuff really, really fast. Now, I totally appreciate that, but I don't want you guys to get mad. We, what did we sell it last week? And I had to keep going because we had to finish it. I don't remember what it was. It sold out so fast. Remember? Yeah, it goes fast. So if you do see something you really, really like, um, you don't want to wait. At least jot the item number down at a minimum. Uh, and we, everybody's on it. When it sells out, everybody just says it. <laughs> and I really appreciate that. All right, Lenine, my husband here is wondering if you would say hi to him. Yes. What is Lenine? What is your husband's name. Well, just give me that. Can you watch that for me, Evelyn, while I get busy? All right, guys, here we go. Miss Stephanie and Ken, of course, is there being the fabulous, <laughs> oh so talented camera person. Uh, she is joining us from <laughs> the Stamps of Life. Yay! <laughs> Round of applause. Hi, do you have a joke for us, Stephanie? Can you tell us a good old joke? I, I do not have a joke, but my husband did kind of wave to the camera, but you couldn't see him. But he's over there. He did wave to Does you when Ken you said his have name. A joke? So, Does any, we need yes. a joke. Does Ken have a joke? Yeah. <laughs> no, none you can think I, of. I, Ken says our whole lives are a joke. So, I mean, he's kind of like. Actually, I do have a joke. I do have a joke. So, our, our, um, our company name, we go by TSOL a lot, the Stamps of Life, TSOL. Well, spelled backwards, it's lost. <laughs> and we feel that way quite a bit. Because when we started our company, we started it on a dare and a prayer. My uncle dared us to start a company, and we prayed a lot about it. And here we are 12 and a half years later, and we're doing this full time, and we just feel so blessed. But um, half the time, we do feel lost. <laughs> Did you realize it was lost backwards? Yeah, probably not in the beginning. I mean, I didn't even, I honestly, yeah, I don't even really know where the name came from. I mean, it was just kind of one of those things. Okay, we'll try it. And, That's and crazy. it kind of took off a little bit. So well, yeah, and, and yeah, you, know what, you guys really inspire so many of us too, you know, because really it is. I mean, you're starting at a dare, which is even better. And then you're like 12 years later and you guys are so rocking it and you're still rocking it and coming out with really cool innovation. Oh, now here's what I love about thank what you, you. See. we have. We have really interesting variety tonight from Steph. And one of the things yes. I think is going to very much surprise you guys, so stick around to see that. But here we go. Someone said congratulations online to me. And isn't that a great segue? Someone knew what we were doing. So it was let's perfect. go over to my overhead real quick. And this is so cute. This is part of um, Steph's famous cut in die set. And it's the word congratulations. And you're going to be able to make a full card out of it. So Steph, why don't you get busy and show us the pieces and parts and how it works. And then I'll work on mine too. Absolutely. Okay. So what it is, is it's a folded die. And a lot of times people are kind of confused by what a folded die means. Well, it's just a shaped card. So for example, this one says congratulations, and it's coming with three dies. So it has one, two, three. Let's do the overhead, Kenny, so they can see it. Um, it comes with three dies, but the best part about it is all of the letters are separate. So you can do something like that, right? You can have all of those letters cut out in different colors and you can run that through. So let's kind of go through how to make a fold it and then we can kind of start putting this together. But this is what it looks like. We're gonna open and close it. Isn't that cute? Look at that. Now, I have a couple other samples I wanna show you before I actually show you how to do this. Here's a cute one that says congratulations. But the fun thing about this one is it literally stands yeah. up. 
Look at that. You nice. can have it stand up. Imagine having that on your desk or something, or giving it to someone so they can put it on their desk. You know, just something. And congratulations. Here's another cute one. Congratulations. So what is it? Let's see. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to take a piece of cardstock and we're simply going to fold it in half. I always like to say that's the hardest part because, you know, it's really not. This is so easy. If it's not easy, I'm not going to do it and I don't expect anyone else to do it. So that's kind of where I'm at. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the largest die that's in the kit, the largest die, and on the back, on the back of the die, it says place fold here or place fold here on the side. So I know you're not going to really be able to see it, but we'll kind of try to zoom in on it so you I'm can kind of see too. yeah kind of see it there oh there it is place fold here right there there you, it is you guys so what we're gonna do at home yes oh absolutely yeah. and i'm gonna run it through my machine my fold is right here i'm gonna run it through the machine just like this so i can see through the die so the die is on the edge of that paper so when i run that through i'm gonna get something that looks like this and it just opens and closes like that. But ooh, this doesn't look very nice, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna die cut it regular so I have all those cute little fun curves and things like that. And then I'm just gonna add my adhesive. So I'm just gonna run some adhesive over this and I'm gonna add this. And this is just my card base. This is gonna get me started. This is gonna get me you know, exactly where I need to be. So now I have this, right? Now I have my real card, just like that, open and close. And then I'm going to take the second biggest die and I'm going to die cut that. Now I've already die cut it out of the white and I've already started to add my letters on. Now how did I add those letters on with my little tape runner? I did not. I did not because here. <laughs> There's a mystery. Here, there is a secret <laughs> ingredient involved and it's very, very important because it changes the way you craft. And this is one of those things that I always tell people, add one of these into your cart, you will thank me later, because it's so important. They are the Stamps of Life adhesive sheets, and they turn your cardstock into a sticker. So you do not have to add tape runner to the back of your cardstock because it will already be a sticker. So what do I mean? What you're gonna do is you're gonna get a piece of cardstock. Here I have some glitter paper, which is nice and pretty. And I'm gonna take some of this, I'm gonna peel it off. It says peel here, so you don't have to really worry. I'm just gonna peel it off. And then on the back, I'm just gonna add my adhesive sheet, okay? There we go. Now I'm gonna run it through my die cut machine and I've already run this big congratulations right here see here's my die it's all those letters woo and i ran it through already look at that and then what i'm going to do is i'm going to get my l here now remember here's where the magic happens because now it's a sticker look at that it's sticking to my finger so now i don't have to try to get can you imagine trying to do this ah you know you'd go crazy <laughs> so now it's all a sticker i'm going to add this here just like that and boom there is my congratulations. Now, of course, my little dot on my eye, you know, I'm a big epoxy dot person. So I'm gonna grab one at Totally Tiffany. Did you guys know Totally Tiffany's my best friend? Um, Tiffany's uh, really? little Barbara buddy bag. Yeah, she is actually. Oh, we, Suzanne, that. let me tell you a quick story. Okay. We met <laughs> one year in April. We met in, an April, in April. Okay. And that November, we went to China together, just the two of us. And it was the best what? vacation, don't tell my husband, don't tell my husband. It was the best vacation I've ever taken. Now, of course, it was a business trip, but let me just tell you, Tiff and I had so much fun. All we did was laugh the entire time. Oh, so it was fun. awesome. It was That's just too much great. fun. I know. It's not fun. I know. I just adore her. And she's met my grandsons and she spent the night at my house. We've had sleepovers. I mean, oh, oh yeah. Gosh, Big so time. Cute. Big time best friend. Oh, my God. That's I know. adorable. I know, isn't it fun? It's fun to hear like people in the industry, we really are friends, you yeah, know? It's yeah, like, you actually like each other. I, I mean, <laughs> yeah, people are always surprised, you know? I'm like, no, Tiff's my best friend, are you kidding? Okay, so here we have our fun little congratulations. Now I am gonna add my adhesive to the back of this. All of those letters I've just added on there. Remember, they're all stickers, so it was nice and fast and easy to add those on there. And I'm gonna lay this down and it's gonna layer right on that purple color I just cut out. And boom, there's my cute little epoxy dot. I added my little epoxy and now I have my card. Look how easy that was. Now, keep in mind, I remember I cut it out of this glitter paper, this glitter paper. Oh, you can really see it on that one. And on this one. So now I'm gonna take all of these, I'm gonna put it in one of Tiffany's storage envelopes. 
the next time I want to make another one of these, uh, I already have all the letters cut out. So I'm just going to make it a different version of this one, and I'm going to have another congratulations card that quick because all those letters are still here that I didn't use yet. Well, you know and you what can else? Really see them right there. Steph, can I tell you something funny too? Like, do you play Wordle? Yes. You know the New York Times Wordle. I don't. Okay. I have to so start playing that. I've heard about it's, it. Oh my God. It's like the total buzz. So when I got done with my letters, I was like, oh my gosh, this is like Wordle. So look what I did. I was like, well, I could probably think of something else. So here's, here's when my letters, I had left my extra letters. I go, wait a minute. If you start looking at all the letters, you can spell a lot of different words. So this is my card. If we can go to my extra. overhead, it's you are so, <gasps> get it? And then when you open it up, I that's, love it. that's something else that's coming up inside here. But so I started just, yes. I thought, because I loved your font style on this. I also be, thought it'd be fun to do congrats with S and just stop yes. there. Excuse me. Absolutely. <coughs> I've had, and I want to point out a couple things, guys, if you're thinking about buying this. Now, you got to think, look at this cardstock that I used. Let me grab, where's my bigger piece of paper? I what did I do with it. I send stuff so far away. Okay, this is the cardstock <laughs> I use. Now, this cardstock we're going to be featuring in a couple weeks. You can see it's glittery and it's really, really thick. Then, here are the adhesive sheets. I'll give you the, there's 20 of them you get in each set. And again, you're only going to use as little as you need. You know what I mean? Now, here's right. what was so impressive stuff that I was using my marquee machine, so I wasn't using anything. I mean, I love my machine. I use it all the time, but I'm not using a big honking electric machine. And her dies are such nice quality. Two things you're going to notice. Um, number one, everything comes off on clean, which thank you, Steph. I love that. Number yes. two, this is super thick what I'm cutting through, and it went through beautifully, you guys. I mean, look at that. It's perfect. So I just wanted to point that out, Stephanie, because a lot of people don't realize there's some inferior dyes out there that you're always having to pick on them to get stuff cleaned out and all that kind of stuff. Right. Hers just come out so fluid and so clean, even on a really thick thing that I'm doing here using just the marquee, which I just want to take a moment and say thank you for doing that because the quality is exceptional. Oh. Oh, well, thank you very much. I just, when you said congrats, I thought how perfect would that be on a slimline card? Because you could make oh, it as long yes. as you wanted on the slimline oh, card, right? Great, that's Isn't a that great a good idea? idea? Yeah, I know. really good I idea. I love that. That's great. I love that. And the, and our word fold it's are really popular. And actually, we have quite a few on hsn.com. And I'm going to throw Karen for a loop if I start talking about all the ones we have on hsn.com. But there are quite a few that you can get that are really fun. And they're bigger letters, smaller, you know, different size letters and stuff. But... The, the, they're really popular just because, okay, congratulations. Well, that could be just about anything, right? It could be the next item we're going to talk about. It could be graduation. It could be new anything, baby. a new job, a new baby. New house. Yeah, I mean, all a new house. Perfect. So there's a, a lot of different reasons why you're going to use. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you got rid of them. Yay, congratulations, finally. <laughs> I have, you were too funny. Right. <laughs> I am so bad. Oh, Francine likes some Wordle. Yeah, if you guys haven't done Wordle yet, it's actually a blast. You got to tell you and Ken got to compete against each other in Wordle. All right, okay. let me give some shout outs while you keep showing us some more fun stuff. Uh, and then okay. we'll move on to the okay. next item. So Ellen says, what fun? Glad Francine's in the double sided two. adhesive two. is the best. Great for intricate or small dies. Okay, so let's give them the item number on the double sided adhesive if we can. So here's what you're getting with the adhesive, guys you're getting 20 sheets. And this is only $10.95. And again, you're going to see, use every little bit of this, guys. Don't, you know, don't just use one project on it. You can use just little bits if you need to. And we have three flex paste an item, only $3.65. It's a double pack and it's double-sided adhesive. If you go online, there's tons of things you can do with double-sided adhesive as well. But I definitely want you to pick up these sheets because you're going to see stuff working with them a lot. And I love it. Thanks, guys, for commenting on how much you love that adhesive. It's great. Uh, Patricia, she just ordered this. She loves, loves it. Um, let's see. Nancy said, hi, better late than never. <laughs> Can't get others to understand. <laughs> Class starts at 630. Oh, she's so funny. Yeah. That is hysterical. You must be out in the West Coast there, Kath, but, or Nance. I'm glad you made it. Francine says, yay, epoxy dots. She loves your epoxy dots. Tammy, I did oh. it. I just ordered it. I hope it was easy to order. Lori says, you got to play Wordle. Oh, now, yeah, Wordle's a blast, actually. Okay, now we're uh, on Wordle. <laughs> uh, Lori says, Savannah always comes up with great ideas. Thanks, guys. Uh, Tammy says, I love my Jesus. I love my Jesus. Oh, yeah, you'll see behind her. Oh. 
The, your sign yes. behind me cracks oh. me up. It, what oh, is it? yes, I know. I, yes. What is it? All, All I, I need, need is, is Diet, Diet Coke, Coke and Jesus. And Jesus. That's yes. 100% yes. me too. <laughs> My friend Melody made that for me. So yes, it's Aww. very important. <laughs> Reagan, Reagan says, Steph, the word folds are is so much fun, which they really are. They are. Like it's so clever how these dyes work, you guys. And don't, don't, you know, you don't have to do the fold if you don't want to. You can just use all the letters right. and do, see what happens is she also gives you like a background. So if I just wanted to put this on something that's flat, I don't have to do the card part. But those three little dies right. do all of this, which is really, really neat. Oh, can I show one more tip stuff too? Tip stuff? Yes. This yes, is one of my ahead. favorite tips, especially when you're working with double-sided adhesives. So when you guys, I take my Cricut hook. This is my favorite tool when it comes to all the little Cricut tools. And what I do is I get under there and I'm going to, because I have fake, thick, fat nails. And so um, at least I admit they're fake, right? Okay. So what I do <laughs> now, here's my little tip. So it helps you pick up and get that started. This is my favorite tip is when I go to place it, I stick it on there just a little bit, right? And it allows you to really position it in the right spot before you have to commit. So you can get it straight, see that? And then I just rub down using the flat edge. So just wow. a little- That's great. <laughs> I don't know, Steph, how you do it, but I just, because of my nails, I can't seem to get under and get that, that's, I don't care what I'm working with. You but. know what? Well, here's a trick for you. Hang on, oh, where'd, I, where'd I put mine here? Here's a trick for you. and. Okay. It doesn't make any sense at all, but it works. I don't understand it. So instead of trying to use your nails, Kenny, let's do three so they can really see this. Instead of trying to use your nails to peel it up like this and you're kind of going, okay, I got to get my eyes on there and I'm going to peel it up like that. Instead of doing it like that, use the pad of your finger. Look at that. First try. Boom. Oh, the pad. hello. Can you believe that? That makes no sense. What but the? But it's the pad of, the, I know. It's like insane. But if you use the pad of your finger, it will peel off faster than if you use your fingernail. Okay. So just boom, a heads guys. up on that. See, I know. Isn't you that all, crazy? It was worth joining Steph and I just for that one right there. <laughs> Those Even two if we, tips. <laughs> if we stopped right now, we'd just all be happy and go to bed. <laughs> but we're not. We got a lot more to do. Okay. So again, and let me just, I'm going to put this together because you know, it's very funny because if any of my friends watch this Tuesday night show, they can be assured they're going to probably see what I made come up in their life somehow because I do, I'll make oh, this stuff and then I'm just like, okay, I'll just give it. Oh, wrong side. Okay. So what happens guys, when you turn this over, remember this is a shadow to a shadow to a shadow, which is super cool. Right. So what I like about this stuff too is you don't have to be really good at this stuff to make this work. These elements that come right. with it automatically make it happen for you. Oh, and Steph, one other question. If, because there's no instructions on this thing, except for that it does fit an A2 envelope, do you have yes. videos online on teaching brand new people how to use these? I do. I, I, Kenny, you'll have to look up how many videos we have on our website. It's at least a thousand videos are on our website. Oh, so you could wow. go to, you could, yeah, I know. I know. Well I, well, I used to be a teacher, so I'm all about education. So every product has a video, so you can watch it. It's also on YouTube. Just go to YouTube. You can type in congratulations, fold it. The video is going to pop up and it's going to show you step by step how to make it. Also all the other fold it's as well. So there's always going to be tons of education and on our our website we have an idea gallery so you can go oh, nice. look at just this all the ideas with this card are going to pop up and you can see them i last time i looked we had twenty five thousand ideas on our website oh my gosh that's a lot i know um, isn't it insane nancy's complimenting you guys on your great quality debbie just bought the kit and oh. the sticker paper teresa's joined us Good. she's in the house georgia love the double-sided adhesive so a lot of people have that and use it that's awesome d such great quality yeah. and value for your dyes uh, have many great ideas. That's awesome. Jonas says, love the word folds, it, uh, the word folds. So she loves the style. Yes. Marilyn, love Good. the Stamps of Life adhesive sheets. They're wonderful. Lori, great tips. They are. Janet says, ordered the Stamps of Life adhesive sheets. Thank you, Stephanie. Julie says, interesting. It is interesting. Shelly says, I love <laughs> a good trick. <laughs> oh, we got a million of them, right? As crafters. Uh, let's oh, see. yeah, it's absolutely. Mia. Just the adhesives are coming. Two packs. Oh, good. Good idea. Nancy says, great tip, Suzanne. Those tools have uh, to do more than one use. Yes. Oh, my gosh, please. I'm always pulling out my Cricut tools. But what I really do like when you're positioning anything, it could be a sticker, it could be little letters, it could be a little something you're trying to put in. I stick it on here because it doesn't commit your whole finger, and you can just really get a good placement with it. it I, it's my go-to tool for a ton of stuff. 
Uh, let's see. Lori said, can't mess these up. Love the foldeds. You're right about that, Lori, too. Julie says, my favorite is your gnome folded card dies. You don't happen to have that little gnome thing handy, do you, Steph? Oh, I don't. Oh, well, uh, I don't know. There are so <laughs> many folded. <laughs> That's a little but some of them are on hsn.com. There is smile is on hsn.com. Oh, okay. um, I know hi, like here's another one. Uh, Merry Christmas is on hsn.com. Uh, oh, this this one's awesome. This is oh, on that's look how fabulous. fun this high is. <gasps> this is an I A2. So look at this. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, gosh, like if huge. you just want to say hi to somebody, that's I know. Adorable. Isn't that adorable? So cute. I know. And There's they can find all those on. Oh, I love that one too. All on HSN. Yep. All oh, on XOXO. Website. XO, all on your like, website. How cute is that? Yep. All right. Yeah, uh, Janet yeah. says she's got tons of your folds. That she loves them. All caps on that one. Kathy says I've Aww. taken classes taught by Stephanie. She is amazing. Love her videos too. So helpful. So I want to make sure we got all those comments in. All right. Good. So, Steph, do Good. we have anything more we want to share on this one before we move to the next one? Uh, actually, I'm going to use this one for the next one. But, so am uh, I. I think we're kind of, okay, look at that. <laughs> all right. So Great let's minds think alike. Now, again, we're going to still use the adhesive on every project you're about to see. Stick yes. with me because you're going to see one. The one die that's coming up, I promise you, is such a pleasant surprise. At least I was very surprised. Uh, wait till you see it, it'll blow you away. But this next one's very cute as well. And this is called Happy Anniversary. So yes. for my card, just FYI, so this is some extra letters. You are so, and I could put a lot of more zhuzh on there. And I used mine happy. But what I did is I used the reverse of the die which you'll see when we work with okay. it. So see, and I tore it. Awesome. So I took basically the leftovers and used it. So when you see what Steph's gonna do, mm -hmm. think you could also reverse that as well. So, all right, Miss Steph, Absolutely. let's jump in. Oh, and then I used the letters themselves on the envelope. Look at that. You know. That's cute, that's really cute. Yeah, okay. that's really cute. So let's go over happy anniversary. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It says happy anniversary. It looks like nothing when you look at the die, so I don't even spend time really looking at the die. Let's look at samples. Samples are always going to explain to you a little bit better on what they're going to look like. But here it is with our cute little tortoise, Yubi. That's my tortoise. I have a real tortoise. Yes, I do. Whoops, wrong way. Um, there we go. And there's our cute little happy, whoops, happy anniversary. And anniversary is in handwriting, and happy is individual letters, but both come with the shadow. So both come with the shadow. I always like to include the shadow die because it's always very important to have that extra background. Here's a cute one with our little our little fox. Foxes is foxes. Is it foxes? Is that what you say? Foxes? I, I guess. Sure foxes? Fox. Yeah, it's got to be foxes. Yeah. Right. There's a group okay. of foxes <laughs> coming. No, that doesn't. I don't know. Right. That does, that does, okay, okay, we need some help. Okay. Everybody online, there's like 600 <laughs> yeah. of you. Someone knows that answer. Boxes. There's some, it there's, has to be there's some <laughs> English grammar teacher out there just, just I know. dying. Just like so. dying right now. Yeah, going, like, ah! It is foxes. Okay, you were right. Foxes, so. okay. It is foxes, okay. it sounds okay. funny. It just sounds, doesn't it sound wrong? I don't know, it just <laughs> sounds weird to me. I don't know, maybe it's getting late, I don't know. But here's a cute one. Look at how gorgeous this one is. Oh, Happy anniversary, isn't that just beautiful? How did you do the background I mean, on that one? Oh, that's actually a background die of no mine. Kidding. Yes. Yes, that's now can cool. I tell you a secret now? Are you ready for a funny joke on this one? Kenny, yes. let's do three so they can really see this one. Okay, so this background die, look at, look at how pretty it is. It's called dotted flower background die and that pattern might look familiar to you if you shop at Costco. Do you know why? No idea. Because that is a similar, a similar pattern is on their toilet paper. Stop <laughs> it. Costco? I it's, I'm, did I, you yes, discover that have, or did someone tell you yeah, that? No, no, I saw it one time and I was like, oh my gosh, that would make the prettiest background paper. I mean, background dye. And so I used it as my inspiration to make these dotted flowers. And let me just tell you, it's probably one of our most popular background dyes, but it is absolutely stunningly gorgeous. <laughs> But it's I had hilarious. To, at so, the same time. so I've got to tell you. Next time I go to the bathroom, I'll never, I'll never <laughs> look at my Costco toilet paper the same. Oh no, you're gonna think of me. I oh, will no, think of no, you every no. time I go to wipe. 
Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So different than when we're at the real studio. <laughs> that's that's a great story. It actually it's a know, fabulous it die. Oh, I hope we have that in stock too. I'm loving that one. Okay, yeah, I'm sorry. That I digress. I that's an awesome story. Now look how crazy this is, you guys. I just this is how good her dyes are. Look at how really intricate that is. And it's all stuck together, which is kind of marvelous, right? And again, you're going to use your adhesive first. Uh, but look at that. But look at how beautiful that is. And it's such a fine dye. But again, that's the kind of quality you're getting from Stephanie and Ken and Stamps of Life, is you just get these really clean cuts and nothing's stuck on them or anything left over. So I just wanted to point that out, Steph, because that's really beautiful. Yes, it is true, and it's true. Now, here I used on, oh, let's do three. Sorry, Kenny. Um, here is the anniversary, and I'm going to, oh, you can see it right there, in my glitter paper. Now, this is thick glitter paper, and I ran this through. Of course, the adhesive is on the back because, again, there's no way, no way you could use your tape runner on the back of this, right? Now, one of the tricks that I have for this is I really want to show you. I've already die cut my background so here's my backgrounds and when you do this because look how like whoa look at it it's like crazy right mm -hmm. what you're going to do is you're going to start with the a press down and then slowly add all the letters so you're just going to go one at a time kind of now another thing to note and this is really important because as i get older i this is really important to me the dot on the i is already attached so you don't have to go look for that dotted I. That I is already there. So you don't have to worry about trying to add that on separately because that is always important to me. I don't want to have to try to find it later. So that I, the dot on the I is already included. I'm going to run this through. Look at this. Oops, got a little piece in there. But look at how easy and gorgeous that is. Again, because I have that adhesive on the back, so simple because look how thick my look how wide my adhesive is, my tape runner is there's no way i could add adhesive on the back of that but i can do these gorgeous intricate dies with those adhesive sheets because you know i'm making it a sticker so it's so simple and so easy so here's my happy and as i mentioned before the letters are all separate I don't usually do separate letters like this, but when it's a short word like this, I easily can because we don't have to worry about it too much. If it was too long, I might not do it, but for happy, I can do it. And so I'm just gonna remember the ball of your, of your pad, the pad of your finger, and you're gonna be able to peel that off. And whenever you're live, it doesn't work as well, but there we go. And so I'm gonna just <laughs> add these. I know, right? It's, that's just the nature of the beast. Exactly. But now I could have even done these in different colors if I wanted to. How fun to do happy in different colors. I could do it like, you know, rainbow colors or something like that, which would be really fun. But we're just gonna add our cute little letters to this. And then I'm gonna end up adding it to my congratulations card because how perfect to have that inside, right? The happy anniversary. So look how easy this is. Now, again, I am all about easy. Those of you that are new to the Stamps of Life, I am all about easy. If I actually have a video series called a 30 second card in five minutes, because I seriously, if I can't do it in five minutes or less, I'm done, right? right. I, I can't, it's just, you know, it's just too much. So I want it to look amazing, cards that wow. I want it to wow but at the same time, I want it to be easy. So there's my cute little happy anniversary. I'm just gonna quickly add adhesive to the back really fast. And then I'm gonna be able to add this to the tip, top, I'm sorry, the inside of my card. So here we go. Here's my happy right there. And then I'm gonna add my anniversary. Suzanne's busy crafting, aren't you? I am, I'm <laughs> okay, doing it. Well, and again, okay. I just wanna show go. you guys, like you're doing, I'm using what was left over. So I'm adding, so I grabbed the little pieces, I'm finding them, and I'm putting them in here, and that's the leftover that usually you would just kind of blow off. So it's kind of fun to right. use that and use this. Absolutely. If you want to. Yeah, that's cute. Oh, that Absolutely. Looks so cute. That looks great. And you know what? I could actually do that too. So here I have my, where'd my happy go? I want to see, oh, here. So here's my happy. I simply could just cut that out with scissors, right? That's what you did, or did yeah. you use your trimmer? I, I, I tore the one and then I scissored too. the other. 
Oh, awesome. But look, yeah, so now I just add the little dot, the little spots of the A and the P and the P and look, the Y, I'm sorry, A, P, P, and then boom, there we go, just like that. So simple. And it's, yeah, so it's like two for the price of one, right? Yeah. But then here we have our cute little happy, um, our congratulations and then happy anniversary. That's so cute. I love it. I know. Isn't that cute? All right, let me easy. get a couple more easy, comments easy. in. Let's see. Regan, pulling the paper from the adhesive sheet will help to get any little extra bits left if there are yes. any. Oh, that's that's, that's a, true. Right? That's true. It they do it does help. Much, it helps a lot to get those extra pieces off. Absolutely. Patricia says, I so, love the ideas of using the adhesive sheets. Thanks for all your tips and tricks. Well, we appreciate you being here. Uh, yes. Let's see. Nancy says, uh, the Stamps of Life and DP always have great intricate dies no matter how small. Thank you for appreciating the details. That is true. Uh, let's see. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Kathy says, a Tuesday night craft Wait, a Tuesday craft night with Suzanne, Stephanie, and Tiffany would be amazing. Too much fun to be had. Please make that happen. All right. You know what? Karen, who's our so part of our social team, she there is you on go. there and she is taking notes. Oh, that's yes. adorable with your foxes. Isn't that cute? Your now, Karen, <laughs> let's tell Karen right now that Tiffany has to come to my house to do this. Because how fun would that be to have Tiffany and I in the same shot yes. with you, Suzanne? So all three of us together. That's, <laughs> that's a great idea. Does she live nearby? Could she I know. come easily? Uh, would, well, she lives in Arizona. I'm in Southern California. But it's like a, only a six-hour drive. She, can, she doesn't mind driving. She does it a, you know, she does it a couple times a year. So, yeah, it's nothing to her. Yeah, good, great. Well, that would be really fun. I have a guest room. She can stay here. We're fine. <laughs> we are going to work on that because that would be such a blast. Oh, my God, I love it. All right, so here it is. And my version is I took from congratulations, you are so happy, happy. That's cute. And then I took the other letters and stuck them on the front of the envelope because you always got to remember, decorate the front of your envelope because that's always Yes, fun. yes. All right, yes, so now we're going to move on to the third one. If you're good, are you ready to move? I'm ready. I'm right. ready, ready. So here we go. Now, this okay. next one, everybody. Uh, oh, wait. And I'm sorry. I didn't give you the item number on the happy one. It is 1309794. It's up on the screen. It's $16.99. That's a great price. Three flex today as well. And you get the four dies with that collection. So there we go. Now, this next one blew me away. And I'm just going to give you a little peeksy at the front of the card that I am working on. Check this out. Can we go to the overhead if you don't mind? Um, what, let's check this out. Okay. So look at this, you guys. This is so gorgeous. All right. Are you ready? Wait till you see this. And it's funny because Stephanie always does really fun, cute, adorable things. And then there was this. And I go, wow, Steph. Okay, guys. So it's one, two, three, four, five pieces. And Steph will explain it in just a second. This is called Stamps of Life Rose Background Die Set, and it's very delicate. It's absolutely breathtaking. It's one of the prettiest I've seen, and again, you get dies. And again, you can do these with um, uh, 3D's pop-up die set sold separately if you want to do that. I think you're going to show us that. Just really add, and it's for an A2 card. Um, but what I did on mine was I actually cut off on both edges so it just looks like it's spilling over the sides. I actually took these two edges off to use it a little, you know, a little bit a different way. So Steph, walk sure. us through this one. I loved seeing this. Very delicate. Again, runs through beautifully. But kind of explain what you did and why you guys did this one. Okay, yeah, this one. I and you and I were talking ahead of time before um, we started this, and you said, "Well, this is like a little out of your your normal." And I said, "You know what? It is." But I saw a design like this actually. Okay, this time it was in a chair at a restaurant, and I'm like, "Oh my gosh, I could do a pretty rose like that!" And so, you know, the inspiration. People always ask me, "Where do you get your inspiration?" Literally everywhere. <laughs> so I saw it on a chair, and I'm like, "I could do a pretty rose like that." So I went home and did it. And what we have here is five dies and you're getting the flower die now I know this die doesn't really look like much in the package so I'm just gonna grab a card so you can really see wow. what this is gonna look like because look at how beautiful this is where, where, where am I Kenny oh, there am I just like totally not finding my spot sweet spot there we go but look at wow. that flower you are getting the flower you're also getting the shadow die to the flower which is absolutely stunning then you're getting the background piece and then a separate die now all of what does the, all of that mean because it's kind of it's kind of a little confusing and i want to kind of show you 
what that actually means. So let me open up this one because I want you to really see what this looks like. So here we go. We have this piece. This is the layering die, right? So if I wanted to die cut that one, I could. Here we go. This is the intricate die. This is the gorgeousness, right? Now, if I wanted to die cut like this black one, right, where I have all of this gorgeous cut out completely, what I'm going to do is I'm going to die cut the two of those together. Now, I like to use washi tape. You can see here, I use washi tape to, to tape mine together. This is the one I usually use. And I tape it together on the back, and I run it through to get that perfect frame. Now, notice on this card, though, there's also a yellow piece behind it. Well, how do you do that? You're going to use this die by itself. Okay, so to get the dot, the layering die behind it, the yellow, you're going to use this die by yourself. To get the black, you're going to use both of them at the same time. There we go, both of them at the same time. Now, then we have our flower. So here I have a circle die, so I can actually drop that in and I can um, use that to decorate my card. And then, whoops, sorry. Then I have my gorgeous, gorgeous rose. And look at how intricate that is. And I know dies don't look really that awesome on, on, car, on, on video, but look, there we go. There's our gorgeous, gorgeous die. It's so pretty. It's so intricate. Again, again, you're going to use those adhesive sheets on the back of this because let me tell you, it'll change your life. So here's an example. Now, are you ready for this? Look at this one. Oh, this wow. one is cut out of gold foil. And that one just, I mean, it, it radiates mm. beauty. I mean, it's just absolutely stunningly beautiful. And it's so easy. Lots of circle dies, lots of options. On hsn.com, I have one that's called Happy Spring. And so that's the one I actually die cut. Now, look at how intricate this is. Now, with the adhesive, somebody said, oh, with the adhesive on the back, it makes it so much easier to weed it. Look at that. Couple flicks, and they're all just falling out. That's because great. look at that. I don't think I have any pieces missing. Look, done. Look at that. So gorgeous. You can see more of my hand than you can the die because that's how intricate it is. And that happy spring is on hsn.com. Um, so you can get that as well. It drops in there. You can literally run it through at the same time. You can see I taped it in there and I ran it through at the same time. Mm -hmm. So it layers in there perfectly. And look at how stunningly gorgeous that is. It is so intricate. I wish you could like hold it. I wish you could hold it because it's so intricate. Now I'm going to peel this off and we are going to have this, look at this, just peel off. Now we'll let me remind and everybody too, guys, what she's using yes. is the Stamps of Life adhesive sheets. You get 20 sheets yes. and they're a really nice size. So you get 20 of these, they're double-sided. So you can do all this stuff that she's showing you, okay? So just a little right, heads up. Right. If you haven't gotten those yet, a lot of you already picked them up. There they are. And again, use little bits of it. You know, don't just waste the whole thing. I mean, use every, right. little, every and, inch of this. Absolutely. And you know what? As a matter of fact, uh, Suzanne, here I have, like, if I don't use all of it, what I do is I save my scraps in a special spot. These are my sticker scraps because they have the adhesive on the back. They go in a special spot on my desk. So the next time, maybe I just need to cut out a couple flowers. Well, I already have the adhesive on the back. So I'm just going to go ahead and cut those flowers out of the scraps that have the adhesive on the back. So these are special scraps. So they go in a special spot on my desk. <laughs> Say that 10 times fast. I know, right? Special, special spot on my desk. Um, spe special blah, 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 blah. scraps. <laughs> Exactly. But look at how just gorgeous that is. Absolutely stunning. So intricate. When you get this home, you're going to go, wow, I can't believe they can make a die that intricate. And I can't believe Stephanie made a die that intricate. Well, That's what you, you're going to say. Well, no, you know what? That's what it was just so amazing when I opened up my box of goodies and I was like, I was like, oh, yes, the congrats is so Steph. And then I got to this and I was like, oh, wow, this is a whole different ball game. Oh, I love it on the it horizontal is. like that. That was fun, too. So think about working at that. Oh, yeah. Way. Yes. Oh, that's a good point. That's a definitely a good point. You can do this card horizontal. It is A2 in size, four and a quarter by five and a half, the most popular size of cards. Or you could do it vertical. That's up to you. So both ways, it works perfectly. There's that rose again, which is just absolutely stunning. Oh, my goodness. Here's another one rose. where... I know. Isn't it just beautiful? Oh it's gosh, just, yeah. I just look at it and I just sigh. I just go, oh, that's so pretty. I love it. I love it. Well, and but, you know what, um, Steph, can I ask you this question? Because it always, it yes. still amazes me to this day. As much as I've crafted for all these years and I love doing it, I love taking a plain old piece of paper, using a die, and watch the magic happen. 
there's still such oh. a thrill to that to me because you know paper's kind of boring in general you know so it's so neat that these dyes you know and again this paper by the way the stuff that i'm using is coming up in a couple of weeks it's beautiful right but look what happened I mean, it's a plain piece of paper I mean, it's pretty but it's a piece of paper but then look what happens right. the magic occurs now just fyi guys i dug because this reminded me of anna griffin a little bit so i dug into my anna goodies got grabbed a ribbon grabbed a little three-dimensional sticker from her to finish off the cards i really kind of did it uh in that and really not on purpose but i thought well that works together really well so if you sure. buy other products from crafters companion and you know all the other great uh, companies we work with think about what you have and then think about incorporating that to what you have already um and i love being right. able to do that and I just like look at that it's like here we started out as our first card which is just so cute and so fun and then we yep. went to here and, and Steph, really, thank you so much because this is just so inspirational to work with this lacy design. Oh. It really is. Yeah, I, I, I really, really like this. And this is one of my favorites, especially with the happy spring in there. And so look at that on the website too, hsn.com. That happy spring is on there. And again, it literally will just drop in there and you can run it through at the same time. So you don't have to, you know, I, I try to make it, you know, I. This is what I always like to say. I'm an end user. I'm a card maker. I design things that I want, and for some lucky reason, uh, some people like it, <laughs> and that's great. But I'm actually using this. I'm like you, Suzanne. You're, you, I mean, there's not a whole bunch of crafters out there, but you are a serious crafter. You really do this at home, and yeah. there's a difference. Yeah. There's a difference. Do I have a fancy art degree from some fancy art degree school? No. I'm just a crafter. I just want this. I just make stuff that I like, that I want, that's my style. And, you know, I think that kind of shows because I make it so it's versatile. I make it so you can do different things with it. I want you to be able to use this in 10 years. I want you pulling this die out in 10 years and using it again and again and again. And every time, every time in between those 10 years, you know, I always want make, make sure things go together. So any of the circles that you find are going to go in here. So it's always really important to me that everything just goes together and and you're going to be using things over and over and over again. Which That's is, really important to me. And so. I'll show you something else. I just want to double check. Um, yes, we had a question. It is an A2. But look at this anniversary. Yes. If I wanted to take the anniversary, we just did. And remember, look how fancy that font is on the anniversary. How pretty would yes. that be? Again, you'd have to go this way with it. But wouldn't that be gorgeous, even if you put it inside or something? If I did this horizontal, I could have used anniversary in a different color down below. So that would have been kind of neat, too. Um, and then I took one more rose, because I just kept making them. And I put it on the front of the <gasps> card, on the envelope. So uh, oh, you know, always that's so pretty. envelope. All right, going to get a couple yes. of comments in while you show us some other things here real quick. Let's see. Uh, uh, um, uh, Elena says, I like the inspiration to mix and match companies and sets. Thank you. It's, it's fun when you, you know, you collect a lot of stuff. Uh, Patricia says, love that the Stamps of Life Circle dies work back with the new die. I do have a question on that though, Steph. How do we know for sure yes. the circle ones that are online, like your Think Spring, is going to fit inside that circle? Is there any indicator on that? Uh, no, but they're all that size. So you're okay. good. So you're good. So don't worry about <laughs> Does that make sense? I'm sorry. It doesn't say like, oh, this goes in that one. No, but it does. Um, because they're all the same size, I believe. And I guess I can pull out my handy ruler because I'm a big ruler person. Um, let's see. So this is a two and a half inch circle. So any of the two and a half inch circles from Stamps, from Stamps of Life will fit in that hole. And uh, don't forget, other circles you have from other companies will fit as well. So well, don't think you're limited to the stamps of life. Well, Any circle dies you have. What's kind of fun is you give us a circle die, which is the exact shape of that circle. So if you've got a stamp yes. set, maybe you've got the Crafters Companion Today special, and it fits inside the circle, remember, you can actually stamp and then cut that circle out and then use it in the center of this. So believe it or not, this right. little circle uh, die that comes with this is actually super handy. Do not lose this one. It is. Also, it would really yeah. be fun is if you made a window out of that. And then you opened it up and used it as a whole. Oh, like that would be pretty cool. That would too. be really pretty. Yeah, or even that would a shaker. be very pretty. This would be pretty as a shaker. Yes, it would. Okay, it really would. quickly, it... Lori says Stephanie exclamation point awesome exclamation point. Reagan loves your philosophy. I think that's great. Lori says oh, the stamps of life is addictive. It is indeed. Patricia <laughs> says I love to decorate the envelopes to match the cards. Yeah, I do too. You know, I I almost like slap my own hand when I forget to do it, and I'm like, oh man, I forgot to decorate. And then I got to pull everything back out and like stamp the card, <laughs> the envelope, because I'm like, oh, I forgot. There's something about putting something on the envelope that just sort of seems 
finished and, and good. Uh, or what happened? That's true. Uh, what do you show? Oh, is that That's the true. horizontal one? Oh, oh, just yeah. This is the horizontal one. I just wanted to show that one again. Oh, the, it's on the lights. It's kind of the. It's the foil paper. It just looks absolutely mm -hmm. gorgeously stunning because. You know, it just it just kind of brings it up a notch when you use the glitter paper or the foil paper or the the specialty papers because you know it is very very intricate. And so when you're bringing in those intricate dyes, you want to use the specialty papers because you want it to even look even more special. And those specialty papers really just kind of add a different look to it. Um, so that's why I, I prefer those, just because I think it looks even better. So oh, here's another one. So oh, um, they, yeah, yeah, there's I the just spray. I know. Is that pretty? It and even there if go. you just there use you that rose over and over and over again, you see I used it on the front oh, of that? Oh, yeah. That's yeah, here alone. it is on the corner. Can yep. you imagine just doing those all over a car to be amazing? All right, guys, so oh, here's your item would. number for this one. It is 130-9799-2399. We do have three flex tonight of only $8, any major credit card. You can buy it online right now. You do not have to wait. I highly recommend this one. I think it is absolutely breathtaking. I think you'll use it so many times on so many different cards. Or your even um, scrapbook page would be beautiful to use those roses if, for a wedding. Oh, it would. Gorgeous. And then just a quick reminder, oh, the 20 would. sheets of the double-sided adhesive. This stuff is kind of a must-have. It will make your life a yes. lot. And even if, if you're doing a lot of letters of anything or a lot of pieces and parts, if you have dyes that are really intricate, you'll find this just to be... Right. It, just makes life so much easier. And that is still it available. Does. We will pop the item number up one more time on it. It is 703950, and it's only $10.95, and you get 20 sheets. And they're a nice size, too. What size are these? Nine by? Yeah, they're six, they? by six, six by six. six? They're six yeah. by six. Yes. Yeah. yes. So, and, and they'll work with anybody's dyes. So that's important, too. Yeah. They'll, they'll work with anybody's dyes. So you don't have to be concerned about, oh, are they going to work with my Crafter's Companion dyes or my other dyes? They'll work with anybody's dyes, so you don't have to worry about that. Awesome. So, and right. in any machine. Well, Miss yeah. Stephanie, we love you so very much. Say hi to Ken Thank for us. Thank you. He's awesome. I will. He's always there, too. And we can't wait to have you back soon, okay? Okay. Thank you so much, Suzanne. I had a great time. Bye, Stephanie. Okay. Bye-bye. All right, guys. Just a couple quick more comments, then we're going to wrap it up tonight. We also want to know where to find uh, this. Oh, she, they want to find.